Hey guys, what's up? My name is Falu and welcome back to some more Danyan Rampa. Let's jump right in. It's been a while since I last played, unfortunately. I've been extremely busy. I'm very sorry. I will tell you guys more about that in a second, but let's load this up. First and foremost, daily life, great time. Let's go. I like this music. It's so nice. Okay, so it's been a little bit. Still kind of remember the controls, but I might get a little confused sometimes. I'm sorry. Maybe I should write down what Sayaka told me earlier. Oh, interesting. It's a toolkit. Must be brand new. It's still in the shrink wrap. Yeah, okay. I don't think I need it. Okay, well, I guess we can take a look at the sword we brought. The only thing in my room is a fake sword covered in gold. All it does is make me feel that much more uncomfortable. <laughs> yep, I don't blame you. <laughs> For Makoto. Did you, did you take a shower yet? It's been like two weeks, man. Door doesn't quite fit in the door frame. Have to make sure to remember the trick to opening it. Yes. Okay. So, what's happening right now is I'm actually in the process of moving. So, um, we're selling the hills, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna be signing, signing, signing my lease this week. So, yeah, leave the area. So yeah, it's a, uh, there's a lot of stuff going on in my life right now. Because not only that, but, hi Sakura! Not only that, but, oh! Hi, <laughs> Sayaka! <laughs> um, I'm also um, working right now, working from home. And I will be starting school my last year uh, in September, so, well, at the end of August really but yeah so there's a lot of stuff going on right now so I'm very very sorry if it takes me a long time to upload these we don't have much time hello did you need something hmm should I talk to Sakura for a while go see who else is around let's I really want to talk to Sakura but I'll be back I'll be back for you girl I also want to see that um uh that Oh, hey, dude. Why am I drawing, drawing a blank on your name? I want to see that, uh, that machine? Like that Monokuma machine? Is it in here, maybe? Or is there somebody in here? Is somebody gonna stab me? That's all I want to know. What's back here? <gasps> I can go back here. Oh, look at all that food! Oh my god, they're never gonna starve! Holy Jesus, these look delicious! They look like actual <laughs> like pictures of veggies. That's great! Colorful vegetables have been stacked in a huge pile. There's so many dif different kinds. And all super healthy, I bet. Still, I'd rather have some cake. <gasps> nice! Some more Monokuma coins! Ooh. We found the weapon Saika wanted. Okay, so camera. Surveillance camera. Hate the idea that someone might be watching me right now. Have to keep in mind that it's against school regulations to mess with any of the cam cameras. As much, as much as it gets on my nerves, I'd better leave it alone. There are some kitchen knives hanging on the wall. There's a whole bunch of different kinds. I had no idea you needed so many to cook. Boy, you don't even know. There's, there's a lot of stuff to cook when you're, uh, to chop up when you're cooking, so. Ooh. Are those some meats, I guess? All right, this is one of the monitors Monokuma appeared on. 
Right now it's just showing the skull crest. Don't even want to think about when he might show up on that thing next. Ugh. It's a deli style display case. There's all kinds of food and stuff lined up inside. Is that fish at the bottom? I love fish. Yeah! Seven Monokuma coins! Alright, there wasn't anything else, right? Let's take a look around real quick. Yeah. Okay, we're good. How did we exit it again? I forget. How is it? Okay, R. <laughs> My bad. Leave the kitchen? Yes. I also might have to pause for a sec. Just because my sister's on the way. It's my mom's birthday today, so. Happy birthday, mom! Um, she's dropping by some. Uh, ooh, there's something at the clock. Are we gonna find Monokuma coin behind the clock? She, she's gonna jump by some, some cake and some cupcakes and stuff. I'm excited. There's a clock telling me what time it is, but I can't see outside, so I have no idea if it's even right. No coins here. Leave this area. Yes. We gotta find that Monokuma uh, Gashapon or whatever. What's up, dude? Leon. There we go. That was his name. I remember now. Hina! I love Hina. Can we go in here? Yes, we can! Ooh, this blackboard, <laughs> this blackboard belongs to us now. Secret, secret beauty. Here's Kyoko and Hiro. Oh, I love Hiro. Okay, hold on. Okay, so monitor clock. I'm guessing it's gonna be the same dialogue, but clock tell me what time it is, but I can't see outside. Yeah. It's one of the monitors, one of whom my peers on. Yeah. How do you pronounce that? I just go like, ugh. Okay. Well. Hi, Kilko. Why? Who set all this up? And why did it choose us? There are so many mysteries. Hmm, should I talk to Kilko? I'm gonna see who else is around. But I wanna see Hiro as well. I'm right, right? I'm right, right? <laughs> I mean, the school is totally elite and unique, <laughs> unique, right? So maybe this is normal for them. What do you think, Makoto? Go see who else is around. All right, cool beans. Nick. Oh, yes. Just gonna text my sister for a sec. All right. The Spare Hotel. I'm very curious about that. Let's go in! Whoa, it's so creepy! Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. That's where I came from. <laughs> uh, sorry. I have the worst sense of directions ever. Okay, so we went in this one. Hi, Hina! Hi, the wee girl. Pushing on them doesn't help. Smacking them doesn't help. What the heck is up with those things? Yeah! Oh, sorry. I'm, ta I'm talking about the metal plates covering all the windows. Uh. Oh, I know. We should try grabbing, <laughs> grabbing the top and yanking down on it. Girl. <laughs> I mean, you can, you can definitely try, but... But, um, they seem to be very bolted shut. <laughs> oh, there's a paper one. Hi, Mondo! Mondo is probably one of my favorites so far. Even though he pretty much punched me into a wall. He went Dragon Ball on me. This is the desk I woke up on uh, when I first got here. The little pamphlet is still lying there. Uh, I have absolutely no desire to look at it ever again. Okay. If you say so. But I want to talk to Mondo. What? what? Huh? What? You want something? Uh. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Play the area? Yeah. Yeah, but I like Mondo. I like Mondo, Hina, and uh, Hiro so far. What's through here? Did we ever go? 
Rattle, rattle, the door won't budge. It must be locked. Oh, that's probably the trial room, trial room, isn't it? Probably it. Big red doors. <laughs> What's in here? Ooh. Oh, I like this. Of course, he for me would be in here. Let's take a look. It's a DVD player, but I don't see any actual disc nearby. DVD player is useless by itself. If we had something to watch, please let it help pass the time. Oh, that could be... Ugh. <laughs> I just had a thought of um, your turn to die, where he could buy some DVDs that showed how some victim di uh, victims died. It was kind of scary. Nice! What about in this box? There's nothing inside. Alright. Sup, Hifomi? <laughs> Have you experienced it? The sweltering heat of the summer cons. The frigid cold of the winter cons. Yes, I have. Indeed. It's my duty to create a product that will satisfy the brave fans who suffer for their passion. Oh, you're doing us all a favor, Hifomi. I don't have time to be cooped up in a place like this. Yes, I want to hang out with Hifomi. He's kind of creepy though when he's he's going like he's he he just gets stuck in his own bubble. I guess it's kind of creepy. Are you for real? Ugh, we have too much freaking spare time. How can anyone live like this? It's impossible. You are a workaholic for sure. No way, can't do it. Totally impossible. Should I hang out with Junko for a while? Let's see. Who else is it? okay? What can we look at? I guess... Is that another monitor? Yep. Okay. You're not even gonna comment about the huge, like, freaking boom boxes on the wall? I know they're supposed to be stereos, but they look like boom boxes. Alright, well. Leave the area. Uh, oh, there we go. There's a store. What about over here? Tito! Hi, girl! Mm. I wonder that teddy bear actually... How that teddy bear actually operates. Could it be a robot with an AI installed in it? No, we don't have the technology yet. Maybe it's some kind of bear-shaped cyborg from the future? Hmm, should I hang out with Chihita? Go see who else is around. Okay. Do, do you got a Pima Koto? We could actually go inside. Let's see. Yeah! Hell yeah! I'm going to the boys' back. Hi! Why are you standing here? I just washed my hands! Okay. <laughs> you better have washed your hands, boy. What does this mean? What does this mean? <laughs> Is this supposed to be part of the Hope's Peak curriculum? That's enough. But they've gone too far! The government must not remain silent on this. Okay. Go see who else is around. How you doing, though, Taka? Kill Taka. Is there somebody, somebody in their mirrors being creepy? No? Okay, cool. I played too many horror games. Do the area? Yes. Uh, what about the girls' bathroom? That's where I actually want to go. Is there anything I need to do in the girls' bathroom? No, definitely not. Good, good boy, Makoto. Never go in there. There's actually nothing interesting in there. And they're all stalls. There's always, always a freaking lineup for girls' bathroom. Whenever you go anywhere, let me just complain about that for a second. It pisses me off. Okay. <laughs> I know this is super stupid, but whenever I go to a show or just like visit someplace, it is insane. There is always a huge freaking lineup for girls bathroom and there's no one in the boys bathroom. And I get it. I understand why. Like, we can only use stalls. We don't have urinals and stuff. No, we can't pee straight up. But <laughs> like, oh my god. 
It's so frustrating when you really gotta pee and then it's like I have to wait 30 minutes to even go to the bathroom. And that was my complaint on bathrooms. Girls' bathrooms. So never go in there, boys. Instead, let us go to the boys' bathroom to use the stalls <laughs> when we're at a concert. Some girls actually do that. They're just like, I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna go to the bathroom, to the boys' bathroom. Like, who cares? I can respect that. Okay. Inside the display case are trophies and other items. Yay. Yeah. Cool beans. Okay. What's this, though? Wait. Oh. Never mind. I thought I... My brain is just not here today. I'm sorry. Okay, there's a camera and a monitor. Don't need to look at those. Let's go inside the gym. <laughs> there's balls! Balls everywhere! I like this background. It's very nice. Oh, wait. Notice observing. There's nothing in here. Oh, I guess there's the camera, but I've already seen a bunch of those. And the monitor. Okay. Nothing in the gym. Well, yes. Let's go back. The music is so nice. I love it. <laughs> Ugh. Okay. Let's go. There's no way to get up there. I can see some stairs, but the gate is shut tight. I wonder what we have to do to open it. Kill somebody. Oh, wait. There's actually a basement? <gasps> There's no stairs leading down to the basement. Why do you lie? Okay. Uh, let's go to the store. I kind of really want to talk to Chihiro. Where does that lead again? Oh, right. Yakuya and Celeste. That's a dangerous combo right there. I, I kind of don't trust them. But also, that's that's what makes me like them a lot. Don't dress me as if we're friends. Did I not make myself clear? I don't like you. Should I t No, let's not. <laughs> He's kind of a dick. <laughs> Hello, Celeste. I'm Makoto. How are you? I would love to talk to Celeste. <laughs> she is wonderful. I'll be honest, I kind of want to do a cosplay of her. I like her drill hair. <laughs> okay, the entrance is being blocked by a huge slab of metal. And Gatling guns, surveillance camera, and what I can only assume is a gun attached to it. I did not get too close. Was there anything else? Also, what is that big red button? Oh, wait, no. That's a light. That's a light. Never mind. Okay. Does somebody have meal? Does somebody get meal? Looks like some kind of mailbox. But there's nothing in it. Okay, never mind. Okay, only the monitors. Okay, so let's go to the store. <laughs> See what's in there. Where's the store again? There it is. Okay. Sorry. Zero sense of directions. Thy name is Val. <gasps> oh my god, look at that! Hello, Mr. Alphonse Elric. Okay, Mono Mall. Vending machine. I guess this must be the school store then. Do you guys have puckies? I want puckies. Yep, this is definitely the school store, but it has a kind of Japanese slash Western vibe. Uh, it seems more like a cluttered antique store. Nice! Nine! Nine, nine, nine. <laughs> Alright. What about this? Starving for information from the outside world. If only there was a TV that worked. Ugh. Promocodo. Ooh, what's this up here? Oh, that's just a camera. Never mind. How long am I gonna be stuck in here being watched by all these cameras <laughs> man I don't know what's this oh maybe if I turn the knob the prize will come out do you like to try your hand against the almighty mono mono machine 
Uh, let's learn more about it first. During your stay here at Hope's Peak Academy, you'll find corn scattered throughout the school. Yeah! Okay. Uh, these monocorns are treasures valued by kings and thieves alike. You can use the handbook menu to see how many monocorns you currently have. I have nine. And if you put the coins in this machine here, there's a chance you could win a prize. The more coins you use, the better chance you have of getting something new. Check the presents section in the handbook menu to review your prizes. Would you like to try your hand against the almighty mono, mono, mono machine? Okay. All right, let's give it a shot. Uh, let's go for five coins. One. Gash up on one. Got an item. That's a doll. It is very, very creepy. Lucky. Got an item. Those are scattered papers? <laughs> okay. More, more, more! Wait, what? Did I only get two? No. I must have... Uh, get presents. Certain coins. If you hold the right mouse button. Okay. Turn the knob. Once you insert... What? Okay, well... Hold on. What did I get? I should probably get going. Okay, but can we take a look at... There we go. Presents. Uh-oh. <laughs> Where are they? Where are you? And I'm so sorry. It's going down so slowly. You grow faster! <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh, antique doll. Porcelain doll. Due to the, to the exquisite craftsmanship of the of the doll and its clothing, many people still collect and prize them to this very day. Nice! That's 59. Millennium Prize Problems. These seven important mathematical problems were posed by the Clay Mathematics Institute with a reward of one million dollars for each one soul. Do you think Chihiro would like that? She seems like the kind of person who would. So, oh, school crest. Proof that you've cleared the pro line. To patch that displays to Hope's Peak Academy school crest. That we got, we didn't get from the Gasha Pond. That was, that was last time. Okay, so let me try this again. I'm curious. Maybe if I turn the knob bar. Yeah, give it a shot. Alright, let's give it a shot. Let's just put one in there. Uh one point. Here we go. Turn that knob. What did we get? What was that? <laughs> um, oh God, sorry, I keep getting mixed up and I should probably get going. Sure. Wait, I want to see what that was. Okay, presents. Oh God, it's so slow. The scrolling is terrible. Okay, there we go. Azura's Tears. A jewel treasured by an ancient super race, even the devil has has friends, you fool. And then tears flow. That just reminds me of the dawn stream, honestly. <laughs> okay, let's go. Azura's wrath. Okay. Cool beans. Well, we got three gifts. I feel like one of them we could give to Celeste. The other one we could probably give to Chihiro. I kind of want to talk to her, to be completely honest. She seems so sweet. If we can get her on, on our side, because she's a programmer, right? Like, if we can get her on our side, she'd be a great addition. Okay. Create some kind of bear-shaped cyborg from the future. 
You know what? I'm actually gonna look this up. Like, if the items are good for a specific character. Because I don't want to mess up. Oh. Wait. Yakuya actually likes uh, the... Yeah, Byakuya is actually the one who loves the papers. <laughs> okay, I just saw one fly by real fast and I'm just like, okay, game. <laughs> All right. Okay, so Millennium Prize Problems is Byakuya loves it and Chihiro and Taka like it. I also have Azura's Tears and Sakura loves. Oh! Let's go talk to Sakura. Sakura or Byakuya? Let's see who else is around. Do we want Byakuya on our side? I'm... I really want him on my side, but also he's kind of a jerk. And I feel like I was thinking about that. And there's like, there's a few characters I don't really trust that I feel like are gonna stab me in the back in the end. And there's Byakuya because He's very um, egocentric, like he, he only cares about himself, I feel like. So I don't really trust him. I don't trust Celeste either, because um, she's, she's a gambler, right? So she's definitely gonna do her darn diddly hardest to just lie and get away with it. I feel like Taka is probably one of the first ones who's gonna die. And so is Leon. Um, but I don't know. But let's just... We'll just keep going. Let's see it. Oh, do I want to talk to Sakura? Oh, let's go talk to Sakura. I'm sorry, Byakuya, but... I like Sakura but yeah, better than you. <laughs> okay. Uh, it was back. I'm not using the, the thingy. I want to get used to the layout. Also, I didn't go check. Hi, Sayaka! How you doing? I still feel like you're a yandere. Oh, Makoto, you wanted me? <laughs> Just kidding. Nope. <laughs> sorry, Sayaka. I really have a bad feeling about you. I'm sorry. Are those bathrooms again? This is the girls' bathroom. Obviously, I can't go in. No, don't you dare. <laughs> what about it? Uh, what's it? Are those fish? Oh my god, that is the fanciest bathroom I've ever seen in my life. It's a fish tank. There's a bunch of little fish swimming around inside. Oh, sweet! Four coins! Okay. That's the coolest bathroom ever. Man! Alright, guys, bathroom's so cool. That's a lie, by the way. <laughs> I'm sure they're just, just as cool as the girls' bathroom. Let's go in my house. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> they kind of just scooted back. It was great. Okay, what's this? It's a hatch. There's a hatch on, on the floor. Got a rattle. Well, I mean, there's a very flat uh, uh, lock on it, so the door won't budge. It must be locked. Yeah. Nice. I can't get inside, the gate's in the way. Okay. Oh, there's only these two things? Okay. What about this though? Looks like some kind of switch. I wonder what it does. Probably gets the gate up. Nice! See? It's good to check every single little little thing. Leave the area? Oh. Okay, well, uh, wait. Let me see, we can probably, yeah. Gonna say we can probably take a look at the cameras. It's worth uh, checking those out just because you never know if there might be some coins in there, so. But I guess not. Is the area? Yeah. Yes, sir. Okay. <laughs> Kifumi! Kifumi's room. Uh, I don't really have anything to talk to him about right now. Fine. Gosh. I like these sprites. 
Yasuhiro. I really like him. Leon. Oh, they all- they both have the same face. They probably- oh, yeah, they all have the same face. Hey, Celeste. <laughs> oh, Celeste. I gotta say, so far, I really like uh, Chihiro, Sakura, Celeste, um, Hiro. Did I say Hiro? No, I said Chihiro and Hiro. Um, and... Who did I say? Mondo, of course, Mondo. How you doing, Sakura? Did you need something? Should I talk to Sakura? Yes, spend some time with Sakura. So I just got done exercising. Now would be a good time for a break. Yes. Would you like to get something to drink and talk for a bit? Hell yeah! Sakura and I sat down for, for tea and a calm, relaxing conversation. Sakura and I grew a little closer today. Yay! Would you like to give Sakura a present? Yes, definitely. What would you like to give her? Uh, okay. There we go. Azura's tears. What? Whoa! <laughs> Look at that sprite! She's so pretty! Uh, I've been looking everywhere for this. How did you know? Huh? You're quite a mysterious man, Makoto. Seeing Sakura so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. Hmm. My post-training break is the most relaxing time of my day. Sensation of your muscles cooling down after heating up during a workout is the only true reward. No matter how many times I experience it, I never get tired of it. Do you exercise every morning, Sakura? Oh, wait. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Makoto's got its very deep voice. Okay. Do you exercise every morning, Sakura? Mm. Unless there are errands that I absolutely can can't get out of. Yes, I always do my training. Respect. I don't, I feel restless for the rest of the day. But I'm amazed how uh, you can do it every single day. Doesn't it get tough? Huh. Can't say that. I can't say I've ever seen it as tough. It's also I can get stronger after all. And I have to keep on getting stronger because my destiny is to fight. Your destiny is to fight? Mm. From the day I was born, I've been fighting. Heaven sent me to live as its champion. That's one heck of a legend. Hmm. My father was my, was my master, and my every waking moment was spent with him learning to fight. As a child, I sparred with boxing champions and hit the mat with wrestling gold medalists. I was no match for them when I first began, of course. But before long, they were no match for me. <laughs> you, you mean, you actually started beating people like that? Mm. I'd say my specialty is solid stand-up that transitions into grappling and a strong ground game. Essentially, it's a complete approach. Anything would, anything else just wouldn't make sense. You can only become the best by reaching the top of each discipline, then fusing them all together. She's such a freaking badass! Oh my god, I want to be like Sakura. Instead of fighting, grappling, a strong ground game, that can only be... Ooh. Isn't it jujitsu? Oh, I really want to look this up, but <laughs> I can't. Mix. I don't know much about martial arts, honestly. Aikido doesn't seem right. I think jujitsu is. We mix martial arts too. Oh, I'm gonna look it up. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I just. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> had to cough at the same time. I I really want to get closer to these people because I don't want to miss it. I don't want to miss a thing. So I believe it's mixed martial arts. Basically, a mixed martial arts Friday, right? Of course. That's right. It's the most effective real world, real world fighting style, which is why I chose it. I don't want to just be the best in competitions. I want to be the strongest human on earth. I wouldn't bet against you, that's for sure. 
But aren't you already the best? Well, no, not yet. There's still someone I have to surpass. Oh, she's determined. Really? Huh. Until I can beat him, I'll never be the strong become the strongest. I mean, there's someone out there stronger than you? Hmm. Maybe I'll tell you about it another time, if the opportunity presents itself. Sakura didn't make a sound as she left. Honestly, can't believe that there's someone out there stronger than Sakura. Even if they're real, can they really be human? Sakura's report. Oh, achievement unlocked. Skilling him softly. <laughs> nice. Sakura's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Your maximum number of skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go! Yay! Headed back to my room for a little while. When is the murder gonna happen? <laughs> Not that I want it to happen, but you know. There's still lots of time left in the day. I really don't feel like just sitting here. Maybe I'll take a look around. Okay. I, I still really, really freaking want to know what the lint roller's for. for. I guess we're supposed to clean up after ourselves. Aside from cleaning up after yourself. Okay. Uh, since we still have time... Let's go see Byakuya. Sorry, Sayaka. Yes, we did go in there. Okay. Sorry. I was like, wait a minute. Did I go through this door? Yes. Oh, Celeste! How you doing? Most unfortunate. The Cisco does not have a dry cleaning service. How terribly upsetting. What am I supposed to do if my clothes become soiled? Soiled it! <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> Go see who else is around. Celeste was the one who liked the doll, right? Uh, let me just... Presents. I want to see real quick. Antique doll, Celeste, and Toko. Both of them. Love it. Ooh. Should I talk to Celeste? And then next time I'll go for Byakuya. Because Byakuya doesn't like me anyway, so... He's just gonna be like, Thanks, fuckface. And then I'll <laughs> just be like, Okay. <laughs> Let, let's talk to Celeste. Most I like her. Okay, spend some time with Celeste. There is nothing to be done. Not money, my pride would not permit me to allow uh, you to be alone with me. But, fine. I will allow you to entertain me for a while. Yay! Kill some time with Celeste. Oh, she's so pretty! Oh my gosh, sorry, I love her. Celeste and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Celeste a present? Yes, definitely. I would like to give her a doll. Antique doll. Wait, those are here. Antique doll. Here we go. Here we go, girl. Wow. So I can have these? I may have to revise my initial impression of you. <laughs> mm hmm. The more wonderful things I receive from you, the better impression I get. Seeing Celeste so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. <laughs> Makoto, I would like to share something with you. Huh? What is it? <laughs> my perfect gambling strategy. Is there really such a thing? Indeed. Indeed. Of course there is. Are you ready? Please pay attention. Oh, look at her serious face. Oh, she's so pretty. Whatever the game, you must you must have a mind for strategy. Strategy. Okay. <laughs> this will allow you to increase your odds of winning. However, the exciting part about gambling is that there is a power-up which can overwhelm any strategy. There is indeed. The power is luck. Oh, we're in trouble. Luck. Actually, there are only two types of luck: good and bad. There is no in between. And that luck is built into every human at the moment of conception, like a computer program. Is that okay? Some call it fate. The bottom line is, luck is life. Well, do you see what I'm saying? You mean, that's your perfect strategy? <laughs> that's... That's real dangerous, girl. Jack, 
You see, I was programmed to have good luck when it comes to gambling. This is why I have never lost. So that's all there is to it. <laughs> you are the ultimate lucky student, yes? Does this perhaps exceed my own luck? One day, I hope to put that to the test. I hope you are well. Mm-hmm. Well then, have a nice day. Without another word, Celeste quietly disappeared. Okay. Bye, Celeste. I think my life's been more bad luck than good lately. Gambling's probably not a great idea for me. Celeste's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. You should check that out. Your maximum number of skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go. After parting ways with Celeste, I went back to my room. <laughs> what time is it now? Is it lunchtime? Is it nighttime? It is nighttime. What's up, Monokuma? How you doing? <clears throat> this is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. As such, it is officially nighttime. Nighttime. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked, and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. Okay then. Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't, Don't let, let the, the bed bugs, bugs bite. <laughs> Still gotta practice that. <laughs> the third day here has already come to an end. It's night. When will I? No, we. When are we gonna get out of here? Well, never. I think they've pre they've made that pretty clear. Let's be honest here. I laid on my bed and stared blankly at the ceiling. Before I knew it, I'd fallen into an uneasy sleep. Monokuma Theater! I need an immediate fast-acting fast pick-me-up. If it doesn't act now, it's the same as giving in to giving in to regret. What do you think? Oh my god, I cannot freaking speak today. Okay. What do you think guides the world? Speed, of course. You need the drug? Okay. That's our Formula One drivers are so popular. Any idiot can uh, can accomplish something if they take it slow. Even a human piece of excrement, uh, excrement, what? could create a masterpiece if they spend their entire life on it. Wow, freaking roasted. Okay. Someone who does things in a timely fashion is both wise and admirable. You know... <laughs> oh, that makes me mad when I think about that in terms of animation. Oh, man. Okay. Straight is better than a curve or an angle. Freestyle is better than backstroke or breaststroke. Drive through is better than sit down. A Sunday comic artist is smarter than a graphic novelist. No, shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh man, I'm swearing a lot this time around. I'm sorry. Hell now. What I'm saying is, speed is gold standard for of the stando. Is the gold standard of the Which standard? Is why I said I need that pick me up. Okay. Meanwhile, point zero 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 two seconds later. Surprise! Okay. I strongly disagree with that. <laughs> but you know, 